my name is Amy Hacker and welcome to my channel. So I have been a thrifting fool, like off the hook thrifting. A, I, okay, so I've gained a lot of weight since being in Texas. The food here is amazing. The cocktails are off the hook and I've enjoyed all of it. So I have, like I said, I've gained a lot of weight since being here, um, <laughs> roughly 30 pounds, which means a lot of my clothes don't fit me. And I do want to one day get back down to my clothes that I used to be able to wear and that are so cute, but not in my, not in my future anytime soon. So what I did was I thought, okay, I need new clothes and I don't want to spend a lot of money. And if I like the dresses that I bought, then i you know, maybe I can take them in if I'm really passionate about the dresses. So I remembered one of the sellers on eBay that I absolutely loved and adored several years ago. And so I just went out looking for my size on this seller's website. And for the most part, all probably a good 90% of the clothes that I'm gonna show you are from this one seller in particular. They're all brand new. They all have their tags still attached to them, but they sell name brands at an extremely low price like usually the bids start at 99 cents or 4.99 and for the most part that's about what i paid for these dresses i did get a little crazy on a couple dresses i did go up to maybe 12.99 i think i had a 19.99 dress in here and i went really crazy at 24.99 as far as the dress again they're all brand new with tags and the other thing for the most part they're all ralph lauren so again, the, the prices that I'm paying for these dresses are off the hook, incredible. Some of the dresses are gonna be a little bit, have some bling on them for maybe a fun evening out. Some might be a little more casual for um, a, maybe a weekend or a date. Most of these are gonna be kind of short sleeve or sleeveless. And it is, it's because it's hot as hell here in Texas. I stay hot, it's been winter here, and I'm still in t-shirts, and the people that live here think I'm crazy, but I stay hot no matter what. So the reason why I do some sleeveless or some tank dresses is because I'll put on a really, really light, light cardigan over the top so I can stay cool. If I'm too hot, then I can pull off that cardigan and still look uh, nice. So I'm gonna go through some of the dresses. I think I have almost 40 dresses here. Literally, if you add up the tags, it's about $4,900 worth of dresses, and I paid $385 for these dresses plus some shipping. So it's, it's crazy how inexpensive these dresses are. So let's get started. It's going to take me a while to get through this haul because, again, I probably have a good 40 dresses, but when you're looking at 40 dresses for $380, that would retail normally for almost 5,000. Now you know why I got almost 40 dresses. All right, so let's start here. So this dress, and all of these basically go down to my knee because again, I'm, um, I'm at the age where I need it to go to my knee. And yeah, it just looks better. Now this one is more for a date night. I really like how this has kind of the mesh right there and the mesh up on the shoulders. So it's got some the ruche on the front to hide my imperfections in my stomach. And it's got a really nice kind of knit quality to it. So that is my first one. My next one is again, probably definitely more of a date night, but it does have the mesh here to make it fun. It's also color block. The last one I showed you is Ralph Lauren as is this one here. So again, just a really cute dress and a little bit of the ruching on the side to make it a lot more Amy friendly. I typically keep all my weight in my stomach. So I always look like I'm a good six months pregnant. So anything that I can do to carry the eye away from my stomach is always appreciated. Okay, so this dress, also Ralph Lauren. I'll probably just assume they're all Ralph Lauren at this point, unless I see a different tag, and then I'll explain what dress that is. But this one kind of is a V-neck. I love polka dots, probably because I love Dalmatians, and I, I just like how it sweeps to the side there. 
kind of flares out at the bottom, which makes it kind of like a retro dress back to the 50s, which is absolutely adorable. Okay, here is another one. I really like this one because of the detail, the ruffle on top, and then the ruffle kind of comes down the side of the dress. And I don't know if you can necessarily pick it up in the lighting. It also zips down the side here. So totally cute there. And you guys will be impressed as I, explained in another one of my videos I wear a lot of black but I did try in this haul to go out a little bit into some color and I really like this one this one's actually from Banana Republic so totally cute kind of a halter yellow dress that is just absolutely adorable again I can you know some of the like that dress there is a halter but I could go ahead and wear a business jacket over the top maybe with the belt around the center and you're never going to see know that it's a halter dress this one is a blue dress that last one is from banana republic we're back on the ralph lauren so this is some blue and white it gathers right here again to hide my my funny little body this is another one i love okay so again i love polka dots but this one is white i love the gathering around the neckline and then this little tiny belt to go with it and it's got pockets oh my gosh i can't wait to wear that one all right like i said i'm getting in a color i'm expanding my world okay this one is a v-neck in the front and it's got this detail on the back which i think is very pretty also and it's in the nice maroon type burgundy color scheme our next one is i'm not sure if it's black or it looks black and pink this one is from lsny so this one kind of gets you drooping to the waistline and then kind of cinches at the waistline to give you kind of a really pretty look to your body and i like the little detail again at the neck where they pull in the fabric just to give some fun and flair there now some of the i think i did accidentally buy two of these dresses and you know, the way I look at it is, okay, so if I bought two of the same dresses, then that means if one's in the dry cleaners and I haven't got it back out, then I have the other back as a backup. So two of the dresses I did buy, um, I accidentally went, had backups, but I don't care because I still love them. So this one, V-neck again, pulls through and then the ruching on the waist again to hide my lovely little flaws here's another blue one this one goes actually longer than the knee so a little bit more dressy it does have some detailing up here with some bling bling and i like the cowl neck the draping there and again we have some pulled fabric or ruching there so i really really like this look it looks nice with a pretty necklace in so love that okay so i'm gonna go grab another stack i'll be right back so basically i've got these in stack as many as i can fit in a stack really um so i'm gonna have four stacks this one is just kind of a classic black dress v-neck it um has kind of a detail at the bottom where you have a little bit shorter front and then has a little bit longer in the back, but who doesn't like a little black dress? Red is one of my favorite colors. I just love red. So love the crisscross in the front and I do like a little bit longer sleeve so I won't have to be worrying about wearing a jacket or a sweater with that one for work. More polka dots. So back to my polka dots, because I love them. This one has the cross in the front and just a little bit of gathering on the sides. 
So absolutely adorable. Back to the boring self that I am with a black dress, you would think, until you get to the bottom. And it's a color block situation. So absolutely love how this goes at an angle for the color block, which makes it just a little bit more fun than your standard little black dress. Now this one, I'm really outside my comfort zone on, but I couldn't help myself. So this just screamed spring to me. I think this is going to be great for say Easter. I love how they do, they cinch the waist. And then this one is flares out a lot more, but the colors as far as the flowers on it with a pretty, um, pink or coral makeup look is going to be fantastic. And I do like kind of this very simple top here. Okay, this is one of the ones that I got two of because I'm just crazy. So again, some black and white, the detail crisscross with some sleeves. The fabric is super light. Again, I really like this kind of ruche look because if you haven't guessed it, it helps me out. And I think we are, oh, this might be the second. Yeah, this one I already showed you earlier that this is one that I got two of. What I did was I put a bunch of bids out there expecting not to win and I won. So what can I say? Here is another red one, similar to the last one, but a little different. It does have the long arms. It has a V-neck, and it has a little bit of gathering there. It looks like I already broke my hanger on that one. Okay, this one is from Tahari. And I, Ralph Lauren, I think I have to wear a bigger size dress in, and then Tahari, I think I can wear more of my normal size. So this one's a little bit big. I'm gonna have to get this taken in. But I like, again, the cowl neck sweep right there. It's a little bit longer and it flares at the bottom. But that one is a lot larger than I had anticipated. So I'm gonna have to get that altered. But as cheap as I've got these dresses, I mean, who cares to alter them? The next dress is from connected apparel. I've never wore this um, this before, so I like how it has the detail in the front right here to make it fun. I like that it's sleeveless, but it's a cap sleeve, which makes it still elegant and pretty. Whew. All right, two more stacks. We got this. Okay, so again, I'm trying to incorporate some different colors. This one is just a plain long sleeve blue. It's got a little bit of a scoop neck dress, nothing fancy. So what I will do to dress this up is put a really chunky, like eye-catching necklace or maybe a pretty flower here as a pendant. So. That's what's great about plain dresses is it gives you the chance to either dress them up or dress them down. This one is made from American Living. Has the cross uh, neck, long sleeves. It has the ruching, but it also has a little bit of a ruffle flare at the bottom, which makes it stunning. We're going back to Ralph Lauren. It does have a, and I think maybe this is similar to one of the other ones with the ruffle down the front. It could even be a dupe. I don't have them sitting next to each other. I don't know. I'm just crazy. I got some dupes. The next is from White House Black Market. So I wanted something fun. So this is see-through. It's long sleeve. It's got the cami underneath. It pulls at the center. Kind of short for me. So I've decided um, I probably, if I do something like that, unless I tan my legs, I'll probably have to wear some leggings with that, which will be kind of fun too. Going back to the burgundy, again, I have kind of a simple dress here. The bottom has a little bit more detail, 
but with a chunky necklace or yeah i think that would this one would just be a chunky necklace i think because of how this goes here it'd be too much to put a flower or brooch on and have it not look like it's misshapen this one i really like from american living it looks like it's got satin on the top it's got the nice detail and the pretty side flare so really like that and again the cap shoulders are probably my favorite it's not necessarily too short but it's it doesn't have a full arm on it so the cap shoulders really to me are my favorite i wish more dresses had cap shoulders back to ralph so we got a purple which is fun again crossing the top it does have some detailing throughout the dress with how they sewed it the fabric is very pretty we're gonna flip back to connected apparel really like how this one is almost like a short sleeve sweater it does have almost like it's a shirt over the top of a skirt with a tiny skinny belt wow who doesn't like that that just again goes back to kind of the 50s and that classic classy look this next dress is from together it kind of has a pretty asian flair to it with the beading down the side and the way that the fabric is and i wish it would pick up better on camera but i really like that for a beautiful asian flair i've always wanted a dress like that since i was a little kid and just never have had a chance until now okay our next one is from alfani it is a blue tank top type dress i will probably put a nice belt with that again it's long um, but i think because of it being more of a tank top it will also keep me nice and cool in this texas weather okay i might have two more that looks like a big load over there bear with me we're almost done i promise hold on okay so i do like dresses that have a little bit of a nighttime flare to it also and this one does for some reason I did not capture the tank top in this one on the hanger. So this one has a bit of a sleeveless look um, and kind of a see-through on the top. This on the inside has a bit of rubber to hold, help it stay up. I love the detail. Let me get that rubber piece down. The detail on the front with a lot of sparkle and then we do have a belt that's a sash and then we have a nice flared skirt that also has that see-through material on top just really really pretty now this one's totally outside my comfort zone i like black and i like muted colors because i feel like they just don't it's not like hello i'm in your face this one is a bright color and we're back to ralph lauren and has a little bit of fun detail on it but again that is like a lipstick pink and while i might like like major makeup on the eyes maybe a bright lip to actually wear a dress that is whoo that bright all over that's gonna be it's gonna be tough for me but i'm gonna try it i'm gonna get outside my comfort zone the next one is this kind of pretty cowl neck dress with the silver laid into the material so it makes it really really fun a nice black um, belt around there would just make it very cute it's very high-waisted okay did i already show this one see i forget which ones i got the dupes on okay so we're back to american living so this one is a capped sleeve kind of drapes in the front and again this little detail that i love because it's fun and we love fun the next dress is similar to the one i had earlier except this has a tan backing versus a white again the capped and just absolutely stunning 
Okay. We have another one from American Living that's red. A little bit different from its other counterparts. So basically, I think for the most part, I should be ready for summer here in Texas. Actually for me, Texas is summer all year, so having this many dresses really isn't just one season for me. This is actually all season. Okay, so then we, back to Ralph Lauren, we have this nice striped dress. Gathers up here on the side, just absolutely fun, fun, fun. So yeah, all of these dresses are just gonna be year round because it's so hot here and my body isn't used to all this heat. In, in Georgia, we got heat during certain periods of time. It just didn't seem like all year. So this may be one of my duplicates, which when it comes to polka dots, mama don't care that it's a duplicate. I mean, just pretty. And I love how all the fabric for the most part on all these dresses just really flow which is nice, it's very cooling, um, and it has movement. So I really, really like that. I think I'm down to the last two or three or four dresses. So this one is from Nine West. Again, kind of a, an evening see-through here, grasp at the waist, just kind of very pretty. You could put a nice belt up underneath here and maybe a really good chunky necklace or you could go something as simple as maybe some gray or silver pearls. This one is from Ariana Papel. This is kind of that purplish color here. Has a lot of detail in the stitching along the dress and it's got a fun little carve out in the back. Now, if I wore this to work, I would definitely have to have something else over the top because, yeah, we can't be sexy at work. Come on now. No one will take you serious with this chunk out of your dress in the back. Here is the other one that I said I, I had a dupe on, but it's white and black. So again, I don't care that I have a dupe. Another dress that is kind of fun, it sways. It's got a lot of the blue bedazzle it's got some bedazzle on the sleeve so kind of dresses it up and makes it very fun holy crap okay so we're in our last two i promise you this one is from jessica howard it is a navy blue with a bit of yellow at the top and the bottom so doing a navy blue and yellow eye would be fantastic with the white that is just, again, adorable. And then our last one, and I'm gonna have to get something to drink because I think I'm about ready to lose my voice with all this talking. So another one from Ralph Lauren, a little bit different area of a color block, a simple, again, kind of black dress, but the extra detailing with the color block makes it fun. So anyways, again, you know, I, I could have spent $5,000 at a retailer looking for these Ralph Lauren dresses, or I could go on eBay and spend, what I say, $380, $390 and have basically 40 days worth of dresses. I only wear five, you know, basically my work week is five days. So I've got several months of not having to wear the same dress twice with the exceptions of the ones that I bought two of goodness gracious but um, the seller that I go look at a lot at which most of these came from is BHFO so if you do a search on sellers you'll see they don't just have clothing they have um, accessories they have men's clothing children's clothing uh, purses gowns really they it's not just clothing they have a plethora of other stuff for me I just tend to go towards their clothing because they Brand new with tags, Ralph Lauren for 99 cents. Come on now, or $14.99 or $5.99. You can't go wrong with that. And they're one of eBay's top sellers also, which is, you know, when you can find a trusted seller on eBay, that's always great. So again, I'm, I'm glad I, you know, if I was gonna have to gain weight and get a whole new wardrobe, I'm glad that I remembered about BHFO. Anyways, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. I hope you enjoyed this video. 
I do love thrifting and when you can thrift with tags, how wonderful is that? That's all I gotta say. So anyways, I wanna thank you for watching this video. If you have any thoughts, questions, whatever you wanna say, boom, put it below. If you wanna make sure that you, these videos uh, come up on your, your reminders, go ahead and click that bell that might be anywhere around here. Go ahead and click it. And um, I wanna say thank you to the YouTube community for being so sweet to me. I really, really enjoy doing these videos. And I just wanna say you have a choice, so make it a great one. Until next time, bye.